Well, if you were just checking in with us, in case you hadn't noticed, it is winter and we're still trying to head west. Drying my socks and eating spam, live action video. Well, that turned out really good. We saw someone's car stuck, so we just offered to dig them out. What? Can you go gently? You guys need anything, my house is literally right down there. And they happen to be heading northwest, so we took that ride into this town of um, nothing. Now we're just going to walk out. Might have to use the... Oh, this isn't a snow shovel. Might have to dig ourselves a snow cave tonight or something. It's getting dark. We need to find a place to sleep. We're walking out of town. We're hearing pretty consistent gunfire coming from over here, so... We're going to walk a little bit more before we bed down for the night. I'm not even kidding, though. We're hearing quite a lot of gunfire. Following the deer path into the woods. Hopefully to somewhere to sleep. We're just getting away from the highway. Yeah man, there's been some big ones around here. A bit of poo. Yeah, a bit of food. Mm. Some berries. I'll shovel it flat. Day 11, we survived. Frostbite maybe, but we're gonna go to this rest stop and try and warm up a little. I'm Dylan. This is Dylan. I'm in a Volkswagen Jetta. It's snowing in Illinois and we're gonna do some e-brake action down Main Street. <laughs> yes. Great. So good, stuck. Oh, I can get out and push. Does it look all good? Oh yeah, we're good. Well, we finally made it to Iowa. We're heading up to the 30, 380. We're going north. Oh, we're going north. McDonald's sponsor us. We were trying to decide whether we'd come to McDonald's this morning or not, because we didn't need anything, but Vince likes his coffee and I could do it with warming up my feet anyway. So we popped in and um, we just got ourselves a ride. Five hours west. The opposite of east. <laughs> So we're two happy dudes, so yeah, we're gonna head off to Rapid City and then we're stone throw from Mount Rushmore. Today is our day. gonna be fine he's like in shock he's bleeding from his face but it's not a bad one um, so yeah he's gonna be physically okay as soon as they get him out of the car I think but I got his bottle over my hands so yeah we ended up pretty much being the first ones on the scene there um, cars wrecked guys pinned inside by his shoulder all sorts of stuff not a good scene he's probably gonna be completely fine very lucky because that might not have been the case but we did everything we could do um, now the cops are taking over and the rescue services will be here soon so we're just getting out of here and trying not to um, make it just be a whole lot of people standing around, they don't need us anymore. But we're going to carry on going towards Mount Rushmore. That was quite an um, unexpected detour there, but that's just how it is sometimes. Welcome to the Badlands. This is what I'm seeing as I'm running. Oh, it's just crazy. Oh, nearly fell in that hole. All right, I'm starting to get frostbite. I better go back. <laughs> you could describe what it took to get here in five words or less. What would you say? Pain, suffering, scale. Can't imagine. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. And the craziest thing is, it's like, I it just can't believe it's natural. You know, it's just, right? like, it's insane. Like, they knew the pre somehow nature knew the president. It's amazing that, would look like. that the forces could, could create erosion that would look so much. That mustache. It's, it's uncannily just... like some presidents in the United States. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? It's 
It's unbelievable. It's just a true feat of nature. Right there. Oh, you want to go to Colorado? Yeah, let's get, let's get the let's hell get out, out of here. We get a car about every 10 to 15 minutes. We can't see him or hear him because of the fog. So, um, that could get a little tricky. It could get a little tricky. Yeah, I mean, what are we supposed to do about it? So, um, pretty rough day today, I guess. Didn't really, didn't really move very far. We're in the same spot for over six hours. Wind burn to the point where like I actually had skin coming off, kind of like sunburn. It's pretty cold out there. I'm wearing three beanies right now. Wind cuts straight through all three. So yeah, not a great day, but um, we're in the tent tonight, not under the underpass. Hoping for big, big miles tomorrow. Tomorrow is our day. Well, we're in Wyoming now. So that's cool. Yay! Just so we managed to get a ride all the way to all the way to Denver, um, which wasn't expecting. Still way up in the top of Wyoming, but um, but yeah, we just pulled into Lusk. But we're gonna get all the way to Denver tonight, so it's our lucky day. Giant snowman. Because the snow's all sticky and like rolling in the That's the ugliest snowman I've ever made for my whole life. It didn't look like any of them were cops. Just out here in the desert. We're camping. <laughs> Friggin' cactuses everywhere. And we survived the night, so I'm actually pretty stoked. This is kind of like the fringes of the desert. It's getting more desert this way. But I saw cactuses out there. I saw them. Yeah, we talked to the gas station owner. He said 30 people came through here yesterday. <laughs> so that's not great. So we're going to have to head out there to the highway and uh, try our luck out there with the traffic moving at 80 miles an hour. We'll see how we go. But we met a super nice old dude yesterday. Talked to us about gold. Cecil, I'm probably going to watch this. Cheers, Cecil. Thanks for the muffins. We're going to try and get south or west. Get probably west. Get west. Yeah. Well, to be honest, I knew this day would come. We're walking down the highway in the middle of the desert. No one's really stopping, so we're just going to try and walk to the next national park, which is Archer's National Park, and we can't wait. Not a cop. We're going to walk to this damn national park if we have to. And it looks like we'll have to, so it's good. Right there, dinosaur footprint. Let me do an update because we're not exactly where we're supposed to be. Last night we're like, you know what? Let's take Archer's National Park over Zion. We've got no, we've got no choice. This morning we walked for three miles down the road. Someone picks us up. We're going pretty close to Zion. We're like, screw.
Zebra. 400 miles later, here we are. Nowhere near Zion. <laughs> We've got to go hitchhike right, this nowhere way. Nowhere near Arches. Nowhere near. No, 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 we're nowhere near either right now. We've got a couple of hitchhike rides to get towards Zion, and uh, hopefully everything goes well. We'll get ourselves into Zion National Park tomorrow morning. Hopefully we can get real close to it tonight, and then walk in tomorrow morning. Because everything looks better from above. Nothing's ever as it seems yet, except in that world that I dream of. We made it. We're in the clear. Nothing but deer and mountain lions up here, which is exactly the way that I like it. Hey, look at this. Look at this. Real life cactuses. Oh, they're sharp as hell. You gotta touch them, you gotta make sure they're sharp. It's important. For the ecosystem, eh? Mmm, <laughs> good. Look at this needle, this stick that was in there. It's a cactus spike. Sometimes the rock can actually form so orange that it films these stalagmites just here. Um, I'm not sure what the silver part is, that could be fish fossils, but this part here. Natural stalactite. Stalagmite, sorry. So on the way up here we had a lot of people tell us, you're gonna try up without spikes, without any form of crampons or anything? And we're like, yep. So we're about to find out whether that was a bad idea or not. I'm 22, I'm bulletproof, right? So should be fine. Before you go, cause I can't face this day alone. Oh, darling. People are like, oh, why'd you do this in winter? And, um, this is why I did it in winter. Pretty insane, man. A little bit of a squeeze here. And events, I was like, man, if at any point you want to turn back or, or back down, just remember that fat dude on the sign at the start did this. So, so keep those kind of thoughts to yourself. <laughs> what do you think? I think this is pretty sick. Oh, you thought up was bad. Down the whole of the game entirely. 